Michelle con ah, un tripo un tripo de material con el código de trabajador <risa> descuentos lo llevó Ok, guys, voy a, a trabajar sin la okay. cámara con ustedes porque okay. eh, estoy teniendo problemas como que de conexión. Ok, teacher. It's okay. No problem. Ok. No problem. Let me check here. Number one. He really enjoys preparing food. Ah, eso. Ya la tienen ahí, yeah. ¿verdad? Ok, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Let's see, let's see, I got it right here. Let me share my screen one more time. I think we're back. Again, we apologize for the inconveniences. Here Number we two. go. My father teaches math at a Can university you visualize my screen? Hotel. Let me know. Oh, no, no, floating again. Okay, let me try one more time. Let me try one more time. One more time. The connection is bad. Number one. It's raining. It's raining really hard right now. Um, can you see it now? Yes. No. Yes. yes no. Maybe. Yes. 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 <laughs> yes. Finally. Thank God. Yes. Thank I God. Can. OMG. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. Let's start. So you listen here. You have the options, right? You have the options right here. Let me see. Let's see, help me, help me with the options. Help me with the options, Susana. Help me with the options, please. Number one. Teacher, attendance. Attendance? Yeah, okay. Lo que pasa es que esta página la tengo loading. Let me check. Right here. Bueno, no sé cómo se va a como cortar la clase en media hora y hora y media. Creo que serán dos videos, entonces. Okay. Okay, give me one sec. Okay, entonces mientras Carl. Okay, can you read the options for us? Uh, option and uh, uh, question one. Yeah, on number one. She really enjoys. Enjoys. Mm -hmm. uh, hot. Are you guys listening the exercise? Uh, no, I don't. no, I don't see. Yes. Oh, ahorita está, ahorita oh. sí ven mi pantalla, ¿cierto? Ahorita sí, okay. pero no se veía nada. Ok, let's try to listen. Let me know if you can listen. Number one. He really... Ok, did you get that? Ok, what is it? Chef. 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 Is, uh, is it a chef? Chef. Okay, yes. chef. It's right. Okay, 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 okay. You got it. Okay. Let's check number two. Listen carefully. Number two. Challenge. I'm sorry? Professor. 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 Siento interferencia, guys. I don't know. Let me try again. Dígame. Es que se tarda un poco en el tiempo que, que pensan resolver la respuesta. Ajá, escuchen ustedes. ¿Pueden ustedes escucharlo en sus yes. dispositivos? Y después solo comparamos, ¿ok? okay, okay. Go ahead. Okay. Go ahead. Take, take, take three minutes. Take three minutes. ¿Y dónde está para escuchar el audio, teacher? On the link. On the link, on the chat, here on Zoom. Okay. Véamelo, si no se lo vuelvo a poner. Yeah. Let me put it again. Okay. Mm -hmm. Sí, eso es. That's the problem.
Okay, so that's supposed to be the link, okay, miss? And I'm going to go over the attendance list now, okay, guys? Sorry for the delay with this process. My gosh. Hello, can you hear me? Hello. Okay, sorry. Shame on me, guys. This is the first time that this is happening to me. Um, I am reporting this problem to Inglés Corporativo. Okay, because of the technical problems. Vamos a ver si podemos continuar o, o si va a haber alguna medida que podemos tomar. Um, voy a intentar nuevamente acá ingresar por alguna razón. No me deja abrir el archivo de um, su asistencia. Eh, una vez lo, lo abrí, pues me dio como error. So no sé exactamente qué está pasando con eso. So voy a intentarlo otra vez. Desactivé mi cámara también para, para ver si podía eso ayudar. So. Veremos, veremos, chicos. Give me, give me one moment, okay? I'm dumb. What's up? I am dumb. You're done? Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Super, super, hyper slow. Run, <laughs> run, Okay. Finally. Okay, so let me mention your names a little slow because that's how it is right now. Let me know if you are in or, well, if you're going to be absent, I'm going to apply here. Uh, Mark saying that. So let's just start with Cynthia. Cynthia Michelle Chavez Vargas, is she here? Okay. Douglas Humberto Sanchez Diaz. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Hugo Ezequiel Deras Mauricio. I am here. Okay, just a moment. Okay, it is Yvette Saldana Lenarduzzi. Present. Thank you. Ivan Armando Mendez Parada. Present. 
José Heriberto Cruz Amaya. Josué Valmore Cruz Montano. Ok, thank you. Juan Ramón Navarro Díaz. I am here. Ok, thank you. Thank you, sir. And let's see, we have Kathleen Stephanie Portillo de Lorenzana. Present. Thank you so much. Lucia del Carmen Ayala Mejía. Present. Luz Marlene Cornejo Álvarez. Present, teacher. Thank you. Melvin Rafael Díaz Mijango. Present, teacher. Awesome. And uh, Noel Ernesto Vega Ortiz. Present. All right, Noel. Oscar Armando Flores Rodriguez. Here, here, here. He's absent? No, no, I am here. Oh. Awesome. And Roberto Antonio Ramirez Gonzalez. He is the one absent. And Ronnie Oswaldo Claros Flamenco. Present. All right, you're there. Okay, good. Susana Carolina Alfaro Gomez. Here. Victor Manuel Andrade Galeas. Present. Okay, Wendy Vanessa Diaz Hernandez. Jocelyn Lisbeth Angel Inglés. Present. Ok. Carlos Eduardo Gómez Gómez. Reina Mercedes Altagracia Barrientos. Present, teacher. Carla Lisette Valladares Flamenco. Present, teacher. Thank you. And Jeanette Esmeray Guzmán Rosa. And Rubén Enrique Reyes Cruz. All right, guys, ya recibí mucho de sus daily routines. Muchos de ustedes ya me lo enviaron al personal WhatsApp y les he enviado pues algunas correcciones y más que todo pronunciation porque veo que lo demás han hecho, lo han hecho súper bien. So voy a estar como que pendiente de recibir el resto de ustedes, de sus trabajos. Ok. All right. So let me share the screen with you one more time. I'm going to see if everything is ok. Hopefully. We can complete this exercise. You finished the exercise, guys? Yeah. Did you finish it? No. Yes. I not, I not finish it. Oh. Okay, 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 okay. So we're gonna try to cover that together. Let's see. All right, can you see my screen now? Yes. Yes, yeah, teacher. Yes, I can see. Okay, awesome. Okay, so we're gonna go over number two because we already have number one. Yes, number two is my father. What, my father? Did you say professor, Pro therapist, professor. or firefighter? Professor. 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 Okay, awesome. Okay. Professor. Number three says my father. The person teaches math. My father. Repeat math. Math. At a university. At a university. At a university. In I our hometown. 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 What is hometown? What is hometown? Es la ciudad donde tú vienes, verdad? Donde tú naciste. Right? Hometown. All right. Let's go to number three. In the world down. Downtown. I now work downtown. Repeat downtown. 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 Can you spell downtown? Let's just spell downtown. It's D. D-O-W-N-T-O-W-N. Pronunciation. Downtown. What's the meaning of downtown? Downtown. What's the meaning of downtown? Downtown. Pueblo. Centro de la ciudad. El centro de la ciudad. Vamos al centro. Let's go downtown. Repeat. Let's go downtown. Let's go downtown. Let's go downtown. Ahora que está más bonito, ¿verdad? Let's go downtown. Let's go downtown. Downtown. Okay. Downtown. So what is the correct downtown. answer? Downtown. Manager. Repeat. Manager. manager. Repeat. Manager. Manager. No. Accountant. Manager. Accountant. manager. Or software programmer. Accountant. Software programmer. Accountant. What is the correct Accountant. answer? Accountant. 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 What is it? Accountant. 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 Correct. Accountant. Okay, let's see. Accountant. Read the example. Accountant. I now Accountant. work Accountant. Downtown. 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 Downtown.
Arabic. Arabic. Muy bien. Yes. Buena pronunciación. Arabic. Using software program. To manage their financial record. A ver, ¿quién me ayuda con la interpretación ahí? Futuros intérpretes. Ah, un trabajo en el centro, en un banco, usando un, un programa de software. Ajá. Que administra el récord financiero. Maybe. Para manejar, ¿verdad? Para controlar, para gestionar right? los, los récords ¿sí? financieros. A ver quién me tiene audio ahí. Lucía, ok, Lucía. Let's go next, please. Number four, she carries. The person carries. carries. Ella lleva, right? She carries. Landscaper? No, police. Truck driver? No, police. police officer. Or police officer. Police, police, police officer. officer. Police officer. Police officer. Police officer. Police officer. What is the correct answer? Police, police, police officer. officer. Is police officer? Yes. yes. Okay, let's yeah. get police officer. Man, that is correct. Police officer. Okay, and what's the meaning of landscaper? Uh, Lans... No, no, no. Well, well land, landscape is paisaje, landscape. Okay. Pero landscaper is the person. Es el trabajo. ¿Qué sería? Paisajista. Ah, that's right. Landscaper. So she carries out, she carries a gun, un arma, a gun. Repeat, a uh, gun. gun. She carries a gun. Oh, okay, cuidado, chicos. She carries a gun for protection as part of her job. So that's a police officer. How do you say arma? Gun. gun. Oh. Gone. Okay, good, good, good. Number five. The man will explain. To... Travel agent. Repeat. Travel agent. Travel agent. Tour guide. Tour guide. Tour guide. Tour guide. Or teacher. Tour guide. Tour guide. Tour guide. Tour guide. That's correct. Example. Let's go. The man, the man will explain. The man will explain. All, all of at the historical. Sites it's, it's on your trip. Sites, sites on your trip. On your trip. Okay. That's a tour guide. Okay, and number six. Teacher, no se mira. Por lo menos yo no miro esa letra. Está borrosa. Pero en el link el teacher lo mandó. En el link el teacher lo mandó. No, no lo puedo ver yo. Se necesito mejor si me lo puede enviar al WhatsApp. Okay, ahorita. Thank you so much. Right bueno, vámonos al otro ejercicio que tenemos. Thank you, sir. Oh, we have chats. We have chats. One second. Thanks. Okay. Yes. Thank you. I'm sorry, guys. I cannot check the chats quickly, like quickly, like I used to, because my internet connection, as you know. Okay. Bueno, les voy a compartir entonces el second exercise for today. It's going to be a different link. Y we're going to do the same dynamic, okay? I'm going to give you some time so you can do it yourself, do your best, and then we compare together, okay? Okay. This is it. Uh, Oscar, can you share this link on the WhatsApp chat, please, for me? Right. No problem. Thank you, sir. Okay, I'll give you some time. Go ahead, hit on that link, listen to the exercise, and we compare in seven minutes. Go. Hey, I work on Saturdays and in the school holidays. Saturdays are busy because that's when everyone goes shopping. Our shop sells clothes. Clothes and accessories for men, women, and children. I work in the children's department. It can be crazy sometimes, but it's fun. I work during my summer holidays when I'm not at university. Oxford has thousands of tourists in the summer, so it's easy to find a job as tour guide. 
I take tourists to visit the university colleges and then we go down to the river. We go along the river on a boat. The tourists love the boat trip. But last summer, one tourist fell in the river. I love meeting people from all over the world. C. I like my job, but lots of people don't like coming to see me because they hate. Sure. Yes. Do you play the, the audio on the, the web? But it's great. No, or, I'm not playing or, it. I think somebody's playing it. Okay, bye, chicos. Eh, pongamos el, vamos a poner my job el is Microsoft. very difficult, but I like it because I love flying. Thanks. Thank you so much. Did you finish, folks? Okie dokie. No se escucha, dice Marlene. <ríe> Estamos haciendo el ejercicio ahorita, Marlene. No sé si agarró el link que enviamos. Let me see. Si no, ahorita ya pasamos los, los minutos casi. Vamos a escucharlo juntos acá, guys. So we can make it together. I think I can share my screen one more time. Please listen carefully. Please listen carefully. No microphones activated right now. Here we go. Okay, here we go. We're going to listen. It says we're going to listen to five. Yes, five different people talking about their jobs. We're going to do the exercises and we're going to practice. We're going to improve our listening skills. Esto es para practicar sus listening. Listen carefully, please. Let's go over the audio. A. I work on Saturdays and in the school holidays. Saturdays are busy because that's when everyone goes shopping. Our shop sells clothes and accessories for men, women and children. I work in a children's department. It can be crazy sometimes, but it's fun. 
One more time. A. I work on Saturdays and in the school holidays. Saturdays are busy because that's when everyone goes shopping. Our shop sells clothes and accessories for men, women and children. I work in the children's department. It can be crazy sometimes, but it's fun. Do you know what the job is, guys? I'm sorry? Sales assistant. Sales associate. Speaker number, speak, speaker A works as a? Shop assistant. Oh, Shop assistant. Creo que aquí la vamos a drag. No me deja. Tiene que terminar de escuchar el audio. ¿O oh, no, sí? No, ¿Eh? tiene que seleccionarlo. Ajá. Y luego lo pone en el... En ah, el... magic. <laughs> ok. Speaker A works as a shop assistant. Repeat, shop assistant. Shop, 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 shop assistant. assistant. Shop, shop assistant. assistant. Ok. Do you remember... Do you remember... Okay, let's go back. Let's go back here. Let's go back. Let's go back to the following. We're going to listen number two, okay? Number two. B. I work during my summer holidays when I'm not at university. Oxford has thousands of tourists in the summer, so it's easy to find a job as a tour guide. I take tourists to visit the university colleges, and then we go down to the river. We go along the river on a boat. The tourists love the boat trip, but last summer, one tourist fell in the river. I love meeting people from all over the world. Do you have an idea? Tour guide. <laughs> Okay, tour guy. What is it? Speaker B? Tour. Tour guy. Yes. And this one, shop assistant. It was here, right? All right. Yes, sir. Uh, uh, I don't have the, the same. You don't have the same? What do no, you mean? Because I have a uh, screenshot, uh, WhatsApp. Uh huh. Para que vea cómo lo tengo, no, no. Pero te vas a donde yo me voy. Aquí, por ejemplo, te tenés que ir acá donde dice Check your understanding matching. Uh, estoy en el primero que dice Preparation. Preparation. Ah, entonces estás acá, estás arriba. Ah, sí, sí. Acá estás, okay. right? Tienes que bajar. Go down, ah, scroll okay. down, scroll down. Y aquí donde dice Check entonces, your understanding. Este es como un... Ah, ok, ok. That's okay, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. no problem. Bueno, entonces, complétenlo ahí para sus uh, conocimientos. Vamos a irnos a additional information right now. Ayer comenzamos a ver un poquito de clothes, right? Decíamos que clothes for work. Repeat, clothes for work. Clothes for work. For work. Clothes for work. And clothes for leisure. Leisure. Tiempo libre, ¿verdad? Todo lo que no es tiene que ver con el trabajo. Estamos libres, vacaciones, whatever, right? So let me sum it. Okay, we have we have some vocabulary right there. Yesterday we pronounced uh, clothes for work. Such as shoes, such as jackets, such as pants, belt, coat, etc. Let's go over today over clothes for leisure. Ready for repetitions? Here we go. Hat. Repeat after me. Hat. 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 How do you spell hat? Hat. H. 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 T. 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 Hat means gorro or sombrero okay so it has two meanings hat. Hat. repeat sweater 
Sweater. Sweater. Close vocabulary. Particularly. Okay. Sweater. Sweater. Okay, can you spell sweater? Let's go. S. W. W. E. A. A. T. E. E. R. 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 Boy, R. R. Repeat. It does. It's a sweater. Okay, sweater. Sweater. Okay, I jeans. Don't watch Repeat, jeans. 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 How do you spell jeans? J. How do you spell jeans? J. I'm sorry, J E. J E. J E. J E. J I. I. A. N. S. It's J E A N S. L S A. A. Okay, jeans. Yay. What color? What color are the jeans? Blue. Blue. They are blue, blue jeans. They are blue jeans. Blue ¿Por qué? Jeans. Porque son pantalones de lona azul, right? Nosotros decimos, pasame los blue jeans negros, vos, ¿verdad? <laughs> pasame blue jeans blanco. ¿Qué se me voy a poner el blue jean blanco? Es. So, blue jean es, es, es azul, right? Ahora podemos hablar de las diferencias ahí con los colores, right? White jean, ¿qué más tenemos? Black jean. Black jean. Black jean. What Red other color? Jean. What? Red. Red jean. Red jean. Red jean. Pink. 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 Now we have a variety of colors, right? We have a variety of colors. So, guys. Jeans is formal or informal? Informal. 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 What is the formal? Uh, pants. 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 Okay. Pants. Okay. Let's continue. Next, gloves. 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 Let's gloves. spell gloves. Spell it. Gloves or gloves? Gloves. Gloves. G-L-O-U-E-S. S-E. B-E-S. E-S. Gloves. 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 G L O L B O V E S. Por eso que sea V, damos Vs. Gloves. V. V. Okay, now boots. Repeat boots. 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 Let's spell boots. B O O T S. Good job. ¿Cómo se decía doble? Double. 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 W es doble B. Doble es double. 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 O T S. Good job. Okay, let's go here. Cap. 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 How do you spell cap? C-A-P. The singular cap. is a cap. Yes, a cap. A cap. A cap. What's the plural? And the... caps. Um, cap. No se usa an porque para plural es solo la S. Cap. Um, cap. Caps. 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 Ah, Caps. significa uno. Por eso decimos ah, a sí. cap. Para el singular. Para el plural. Caps. 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 Porque puede ser two caps, three caps, yes, five caps, etc. Repeat. T-shirt. 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 Yes. T-shirt. So you, you remind me to one student. T-shirt. 
Teacher. En vez de decirme teacher, me decía teacher. <laughs> hey, 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 one moment. Teacher. I'm not, I'm not your t-shirt. I am your teacher. I am your teacher. Not your t-shirt. T-shirt. <laughs> Pero como las niñas hablan así, ¿verdad? Entonces, ahí. T-shirt. 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 Now, T-shirt. It's formal or informal? Informal. Informal. T-shirts. It's informal. What's the formal? What's the formal? Shirt. 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 Okay, Shirt. let's go with Shirt. shorts. 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 Short, 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 how do you spell socks? It's S O S O C K S Socks. Socks. And let's go with sneakers. 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 Do you know? Do you understand sneakers? Chocolate. <laughs> the chocolate? <laughs> no, the chocolate is the brand. That's the brand of chocolate. Pero en realidad son sí zapatos así deportivos, ¿verdad? De tenis, le decimos nosotros, ¿verdad? Aunque en realidad son sneakers. Como deportivos, ¿verdad? Right? Aunque okay, hay una marca de zapatos acá en El Salvador que es sneakers. Oh, really? No sabía. Los Sketchers. Los Sketchers. Los Sketchers. Ya, me too. I heard Sketchers. Sketchers. Okay, we have pajamas. 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 Swim suit. 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 Swim the ones towards the right hand side are no, closed tengo, for leisure. Teclado, Let's practice no by listening and repeating the vocabulary. Close. I'm sorry, who's speaking? Who's that? Okay. Hi everyone. In this class you'll learn close vocabulary, particularly clothes which you wear for work and for leisure. As you can see on the screen, the clothes which are on the image towards the left hand side are for work, and the ones towards the right hand side are closed for leisure. Let's practice by listening and Please repeating repeat. the vocabulary. Clothes, clothes for, work. for work. Clothes, clothes for, work. for work. Shirt. 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 Tie. Shirt. Tie. 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 Belt. Tie. Belt. 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 Jacket. 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 Jacket.
Sweet. 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 No, no, no me lo lean. Pronunciémoslo. Suit. Yes, Suit. The, letter, the letter I is silent. Suit. 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 Coat. 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 High heels. 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 Raincoat. 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 Dress. 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 Clothes for leisure. Clothes for leisure. No, no, Hat. 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 Sweater. Hat. Sweater. Sweater. Good job. Sweater. Good job. Sweater. Sweater. Jeans. 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 Con ese, ¿verdad? Jeans. 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 Gloves. 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 Boots. 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 Cap. 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 Listen, 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 listen. T-shirt. 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 Hey, T-shirt. 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 Okay. Teacher. No. T-shirt. 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 Very good. Very good. Good job. T-shirt. 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 Shorts. 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 Now it's your turn to practice the vocabulary that we just learned. I would like for you to talk about the clothes that you wear for work and the clothes that you wear for leisure. If the clothes are not mentioned here, you should add them. For example, Ojo, el verbo que vamos a usar para vestir, right? Hablando de ropa, hablando de accesorios. Va a ser el verbo where a ver where where si se where. si si notan que se pronuncia igual que la palabra donde w h word where. Where. where repeat where where pero el spelling es diferente verdad w e a r where what clothes you wear for work i wear a tie for work. I wear shorts at home. After you do this, okay. Please share Can you your tell work me what clothes do you wear for work? It is. Can you tell me what clothes do you wear for work? Um, I wear blouse. A blouse. Dress, a blouse. A dress. A pants, dress. Pants. And, um, high and in high heels. High heels. Um, Repeat high heels. High heels. 
Hi, girls. Oh, oh, only. Only that. Wonderful, only that. wonderful, wonderful. Okay, uh, let's listen to some volunteers. What clothes do you wear for work? A gentleman, a gentleman, volunteer. Yes? I wear uh, blue jeans. Blue jeans? Blue jeans. For Good. work? Yes. Good. Yes. Okay, okay, good. Casual, huh? Casual style, huh, Reina? Yes. That's good. That's good. Okay, what about wear. you, Victor? Huh? Who? I wear I wear t I wear I wear I wear t shirts. Okay, entonces digamos, and I wear a t shirt. I wear a t shirt. Uh -huh. And short. And shorts. At work, for work or for sure. leisure? Para el trabajo sure. o para el tiempo libre? For work, es acá, ¿verdad? For work. And for leisure, it's acá. Right? Uh, Let me hear you, Kathleen. <coughs> Let me hear you. What clothes do you wear for work? I work. Um, I work. Uh, jeans. Okay, you wear jeans. Hey, high, that's good. High, high hips. High heels. Uh, high heels. And shirt. And shirt. And blows. 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 And a. And a blows. Blouse. 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 Ahí lo que tenemos que tener cuidado, chicos, es que si vamos a hablar de una cosa, de una pieza de ropa, tenemos que usar el artículo a o an. Ah, en el caso de blusa sí. sería a blouse. En el caso a de blouse. jeans, no uso, ahí no, ¿verdad? Porque jeans es plural. Solo decimos jeans. En el caso de pantalones. Pants, tal cual, porque Pants. es plural, ¿verdad? Entonces, uh -huh. cuando sea singular, por ejemplo, cincho. How do you say cincho? A belt. A belt. A belt. A belt, A belt porque belt. es un cincho, ¿yes? Uh -huh. Practice yes. that, please, practice that. What about you, Victor? What do you wear for work, Victor Manuel? What clothes do wear... you wear for work? I wear... A shirt and a pant. Ok, a shirt está bien porque es una camisa. Pero pants. A pant sería solo pant. Solo pants. I wear sí. a t-shirt and pants. And pants. Ah. Wear... Ahí quizás nos falta otra que es una, no sé si la, se llama polo shirt. ¿Sí? La que no tiene todos los botones, ¿verdad? Solo trae como dos o tres botoncitos. Uh, Oscar dice, I often wear uh -huh. a t-shirt with jeans and sneakers. Good job. Hey, how cool. Qué casual ahí tú. Ok. T-shirt, dice. T-shirt with jeans and sneakers. Huh? That's a cool style of working, huh? Entonces, polo shirt. Polo. Polo. Ponemos un dash. Shirt. Okay, polo shirt. Okay. Polo shirt. What about you, Hugo? Polo shirt. What clothes do you do polo you wear shirt. for work? I I wear. Uh, I wear. I wear. I wear. I wear. Uh, I wear. Uh, blue jeans. Uh huh. And boots. And boots. Boots, boots. You yes. don't wear, you don't wear a belt. Yes. Black belt. A, a black belt. I wear, I wear a black belt. Repeat. I wear black belt. I wear a, I wear a black belt. I wear a black belt. Okay. Yes, only. Okay, you work. don't wear, you don't wear shoes. Oh, you said boots. Did you say boots? boots. Yes. Oh, Good. nice, nice, nice. Okay. Oscar, can you hear me? 
Yes, I'm here. I'm here. You're here. You're here. Okay. What clothes do you wear for work? Uh, I write in the chat, but no problem. I for your classmates. I often, okay, I often wear. Uh, wear. I often wear a t-shirt, mm -hmm. a t-shirt with a jeans, with with jeans, sorry, and sneakers. Very good. Se auto corrigió ahí, Oscar. Ask the question to a classmate, Oscar. What clothes do you wear? Guys, me están eh, wow. yéndose la pronunciación yeah. de wear. Wear, wow. vestir. Wow. Y acuérdense que pueden agregar, wow. chicas, wow. pueden agregar wow. accesorios, wow. chicos, wow. como watch. Wow. I wear a watch. Mm -hmm. Sí, mm -hmm. I wear a watch. De, de mano, ¿verdad? Y aritos, mm -hmm. ¿cómo se dice? Aritos. Earrings. 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 Yes. Earrings. ¿Qué más? Braceletes pueden decir bracelets. 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 Hey, y también lentes. ¿Cómo se dice lentes? Glasses. Glasses. Y, y lentes de sol. Very good. Jocelyn, can you hear me, Jocelyn? What do you hear? Hello, Jocelyn? Hola. Hi. Okay, Oscar, you make the question to Jocelyn, okay? Okay. Uh, excuse me, Jocelyn. What do you uh, I have a question for you. Uh, what uh, no what were what clothes okay. do you wear uh from your from your work what do you wear? Uh, i wear uh, jeans wait 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 i wear a uh, jeans or i wear jeans i wear jeans i wear jeans uh -huh. I wear jeans. Any any color? Any color, Jocelyn? Blue jeans, black jeans, or black jeans. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. I wear black black jeans for work. Okay. What okay. else? What else? Uh, I wear. Uh, Blusa, no me acuerdo cómo es que. Blouse. Okay. Blouse. Y una blouse. blusa, ¿cómo sería? A blouse. A blouse. A blouse. A blouse. A blouse. I wear a blouse. Repeat, Jazz. I wear a blouse. I wear a blouse. Repeat. I wear a blouse. I wear a blouse. Excelente. Continue, Jazz. I wear a blouse. Pink. Oh, entonces sería I wear a. Pink, Dim blau. pink blau. blau. El color va I siempre wear... antes, ¿ok? Ok, I wear pink blouse. Ah, I wear a pink blouse. I wear a pink, a pink blouse. blouse. Ajá, porque ese A está diciendo una... Una blusa rosada. Una blusa, blusa rosada. rosada. Ok, continue. Pink. I wear pink a blouse for work. I wear shoes. Shoes or sneakers? Shoes. Shoes. Okay. Flats. Black shoes. Flats, como, como, como zapatillas sin tacón, ¿verdad? Ajá. Sí, son flats. Valerina. Valerina. F-L-A-T-S. Flats. I wear flats. I wear flats. Mm -hmm. Okay. Do you wear a watch? No. No? Okay. I know. Okay, wear. good. I know, I, know, I know wear. I don't, I don't wear. I, I don't I wear. Know, I, I don't wear. Okay, why don't we listen to Noel? Can you hear me, Noel? What clothes do you wear for leisure? 
What clothes do you wear for leisure? What clothes do you wear? Hello, Heriberto. Can you hear me? Hello, Heriberto. Are you there? Yes, I have a question for you. What clothes do you wear for leisure? Hello? Okay, make a question. What clothes do you wear for work? Repeat. What clothes do you wear for work? What clothes do you wear for work? What clothes do you wear for work? And what clothes do you wear for leisure? For leisure. Okay, Reina, you make a question to a classmate. In what, in what class do you yeah. wear for leisure? Um, uh, um, excuse me. Um, excuse me. I, I wear. Um, uh, uh, what do you wear? Uh oh. No, what? What clothes? What clothes? What clothes do, do you, you wear? wear? Do you wear? In yes. The work? What clothes uh -huh. do you what wear? What clothes do you wear in in your for, work? Uh -huh. For leisure. In the work. Uh huh. For whom? For in whom? Work. For whom? Choose a for classmate. Home. Choose a classmate, Reina. Oh. Yes? Mm. Hello? Only one? Ah, only one. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna make the question. Okay, Hugo, can you hear me, Hugo? Yes, teacher. Okay, what clothes do you wear for work? I clothes. What? I wear. Ah, sorry, I wear. <laughs> I wear uh, <laughs> pajamas. You wear pajamas right now. Uh, blue jeans. Blue jeans. Repeat. Blue jeans. I, I wear. wear. I wear blue jeans. Yes. Uh, white polo shirt. Ah. A polo. A, a white, white polo shirt. A, a white, white polo shirt. Polo oh. shirt. Uh -huh. And boots. Boots. Oh, um, yeah, yeah, you told me. I'm sorry. Uh, Hugo, wear... make the question to Lucia. Make the question to Lucia. Hello, Lucia. Hello. Are you there? Excuse me, Lucia. Um, <laughs> what, what clothes do you wear? What do you wear? Do you wear? What, what clothes, clothes do you wear? What for work or for or leisure. leisure? Choose one. Choose mm -hmm. one for work or for leisure, Hugo. For work. For work. Okay, Lucia. Oh, see. I wear um no I wear black jeans. Okay. Um, shirts. Se dice. A, sh a shirt. Shirts. Es una a shirt. Uh, uh, Una camisa formal. Uh -huh. oh, a shirt. A, a shirt. shirt. Oh, and... oh, are you going to do? <clears throat> Zapato bajito dijo como era. Flats. 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 Serían flats. Shoes okay. flats. No, serían no, flats. Solo flats. Solo flats. 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 How, how do flats. you write that? Oh, flats. flats. Mm -hmm. Um... Flat. A watch. A watch, okay. Um, and ring, se dice a mío. A ring. Ring. A ring, muy bien, a ring. Only. ¿Cómo se dice un collar? Necklace. Correct, a necklace. A necklace. A necklace. Okay. okay, 
I I know no, no uso collares. I don't I wear. wear. I don't, I don't wear. wear. I don't wear. Que sería el I negativo. Wear. I wear positivo. I don't wear negativo. I okay, don't. Lucy, make the question to Ramon. Make the question to Ramon. Okay. Ramon, what what clothes for? What clothes, what do, clothes you wear? do you wear? For what lace. clothes do you wear? Lace. Do you wear lace. for repeat, repeat, lace repeat, lace repeat, 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 Lucia? What clothes? What clothes do you wear? Do you wear, do you wear? for laser? For laser. For leisure, okay. For leisure. leisure. For leisure. Okay, Ramon. <laughs> Ahí está en el chat para que lo. No, no. ¿Qué? ¿Qué lo puso ya en el chat? Yo lo, no, yo lo expuse ahí, ahí. What la, clubs? La oración, What la clubs? pregunta. Oh, thank you, Oscarito. Did you get it, Ramón? Can you hear us? What clubs? Yes, no? No. Si no, nos vamos con Roberto. What, what clothes? clothes do you wear for work? Repeat, Lucía, repeat. What's the question? Ok, ¿a quién? ¿Con Ramón? Con Roberto. What clothes? What clothes for you? What clothes do you wear? For you wear, no, for you. Do you wear? Leisure, leisure. 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 Nos está faltando el auxiliar. Do you. What do clothes you, do oh, you wear? Do you wear? What clothes? ¿Qué ropa what do clothes? you wear? What clothes do you wear for leisure? Okay, Roberto, what clothes do you wear for leisure? Good evening, Lucy. Hello. Good evening, buddy. I, good evening. I wear. I wear. I wear. I wear. Shirts. A shirt. A shirt. A shirt. Pants. A shirt. Tea. Watch. A watch. A watch. In, in Friday, in Friday, in Friday, in Friday. Wait, wait, wait. But how see, about how uh, about shoes? How about sneakers? In uh, para para si free el viernes el viernes Friday 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 Friday, Friday. 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 and blue jeans. Mm -hmm. And oh, Paul. on Friday you can wear blue jeans. Yes, oh. in some companies they give you permission to wear blue jeans on Fridays, huh? And polo shirts. And a yes. and a and a polo shirt. Sí, cuando es una a polo shirt, a blouse, a watch, a watch. Yes. Okay. A jeans is blue. Blue jeans. Is correct? Blue jeans, Roberto? Yes, yes. Blue jeans. Okay, Roberto, make the question to Kathleen. Work or leisure, please. Hello, Kathleen. Good evening. What closet do you wear? Do you wear? Wear. Do you for work? Okay. What clothes, what clothes do you what wear? What clothes do you wear? Wear. For work. For work. What? Work. Clouds, do you wear for work? For work. Okay, Kathleen, what yeah. clothes do you wear for work? Hi. I work. I, I wear. I wear. I wear. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay. Uh, I wear no uh, blue jeans. <laughs> this year. Ah? A t shirt. A t shirt. A sne sneakers. Sneakers. And only. Only that, okay. Very good. Podemos ir agregando ya colorcitos, right? Blue sneakers, white sneakers, black and white sneakers, blue jeans. Eh, si es a uh, white blouse, a white blouse, a black blouse, a blue blouse, a blue and white blouse. So podemos ir ya jugando con los colors para dar más especifications, okay? Kathleen, make a question to Victor. Yo iba a decir a cuadros, pero no me salió checker. Check, 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 así es. Check, check. check. Solo que ahí la pronunciación Where? es un poquito difícil Where? con la Exacto. Check shirt. Check shirt. Oh. Es a check cuadros, cuadri 
cuadritos. Okay. Go, Kathleen. Question to Victor. Hi, Victor. What clothes Hi. do you wear for work? Mm -hmm. What clothes do you wear for work? I wear a, a shirt and pant. Pants. Pant. Mm -hmm. Only. Only that? So you have you don't wear no socks, no shoes, no belt. <laughs> belt. And belt. Good. <laughs> Do you wear flip flops? You know what is flip flops, guys? Flip flops. No, I don't know. Flip. Flip. Flip flops. Genus. <laughs> Do you wear flip flops at work? I, I don't. No. You go in chunas to work? Huh? No, I don't. <laughs> I wear I wear I wear shoes. shoes. You wear shoes. Okay. I wear shoes. I, wear shoes. I love your answer, Victor. Good job. Okay, Victor. Very good, guys. Congratulations. Nice job. Acuérdense el verbo where, okay? Where. Okay. Very nice. Let's move on. <laughs> that was pretty fun. Okay. So let's go with the, uh, let me see, let me see. No, we're going to go with this. We're going to go with uh, possessives. Okay. Let's check it out. Hi, everyone. In this class, you'll learn how to use possessives in order to describe belonging of disaster which you learned on our previous lesson. You heard how this topic is used. Uh, let me quickly show you that conversation dialogue and I'll point out the possessives in action. For example, if you notice the conversation, our clothes are dry. Where is my new blouse? Is it yours? No, it's not mine. I'm going to go ahead and grade those possesses that I want to emphasize on. In order to understand this topic, it's important that you understand the difference between possessive adjectives and pronouns and how they okay, are Okay, this is very important. We have three ways. This is one, this is two, this is three. We have three ways to talk about possessives, okay? Three ways. The first one is using possessive adjectives. Repeat, possessive adjectives. Possessive adjectives. Those are adjectives. my... My, my, yes, my, 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 your, 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 is that your, it's your, your. his, his, his is his. for a man, yes, his, his. is for a man, for, um, his. her, repeat, her, her, her. her. And this is for a woman, her. okay, her, her, her. Our, repeat, our, 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 our and their, 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 For the subject dare. pronoun, I, I, the possessive is my, my, my. For the subject pronoun, they, their, the subject, dare. the possessive dare. adjective is their, their, their. For the subject pronoun you, your, your. your. possessive your. adjective is your. your. For the post, uh, I'm sorry, for the subject pronoun we, our, 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 our,
nuestros, Our. nuestras. Our. Our. Uh, Subject pronoun Nunez is our teacher. Correct. Caleb Nunez is our teacher. Okay. For the subject pronoun, he. Yes. Sus. Yes. Yes. For the subject pronoun, she. Her. 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 Okay. Her. For Jose. Yes. Yes. For Margarita. Her. 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 Ok, very good. For example, Her. my. ¿Quién me puede dar un ejemplo usando my? My. My car. My, my car. car. My, my car. Is. Is. A red. red. Ok, my It's car red. is It's red. red. Ok, your es para la segunda persona. Your. That is your. En este caso sería su servidor, ¿verdad? Porque yo estoy hablando con ustedes. ¿Qué me podrían decir usando your? Your motorcycle is, He is your black. Teacher. Your motorcycle is black. Muy bien, Manuel. Your motorcycle is black. A ver, ¿quién más me dijo, Oscar? ¿Ah? ¿Quién más me dijo? Your... He is your teacher. Your name is Caleb. Eso me podrían decir. Your name uh, is Caleb. Okay. Yes? Your name is Caleb. Your what? Your last name is Nunes. Wow. Your class is excellent. Your class is excellent. Oh, thank you, Miss. I appreciate it. <laughs> My students are excellent, too. Thanks. Your computer is very slow. My computer is very slow. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Correcto y real. Okay. Vale, entonces acá están los pronouns. Uh -huh. Acá yo decía mi, como para decir mi nombre Don't es, me. my name is Caleb. Acá voy a decir mine. Yes, mine es como mío, yes. tuyo, mine. de él, yes. de ella. ¿Sí? Aquí era, aquí era mi, oh. aquí era tú, aquí era su de él, aquí era su de ella. Yes. Aquí era nuestro. Y aquí era de ellos. Acá es mío, tuyo, right? Repeat, mine. 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 It's, it's mine. mine. It's mine. It's mine. It's mine. It's mine. Y para decir mi nombre es. My name. My name. My name. My name. Es el posesivo adjective, ¿sí? Ok, usualmente los possessive pronouns van al final, usualmente. Por ejemplo, el de he sigue siendo his, no cambia ese. Ok, es el mismo possessive adjective en possessive pronoun. El de ella cambia un poquito, le agregamos ese. Hers. Hers. Antes era her. 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 Yeah. her. Ahora her. Her. De ella. El ejemplo dice, her. these socks, así se va a usar. These socks are her. her. Yo quiero decir, este traje es mío. ¿Cómo puedo decir? This suit is mine. Mine. ¿Sí? Ok. De nosotros, our, ahora es ours. Nuestro, nuestra, nuestros, nuestras. Ours. Nuestro. These socks are ours. Socks are ours. These socks are ours. I don't share my socks with socks. anybody. You don't share <laughs> your socks. Yeah. It's not They recommended. De, ahora de ellos, theirs. De ellos. These theirs. socks are theirs. Theirs. These socks are theirs. Yes. Es de ellos, estos calcetines. These socks are theirs. These socks are okay, theirs. nice. Y ahora vamos con names. Ahora, con names, vamos a ponerle al nombre un, una comita que en inglés se llama apostrophe. 
apostrophe y ponemos la letra S en el noun, en el nombre. Por ejemplo, Julie, el posesivo va a ser Julie's. Repeat. Julie's jeans. Estos pantalones de lona son de Julie. Rex, ponemos apostrophe S. Rexes, pronunciamos la S. Rexes. T-shirt. T-shirt. Por ejemplo, Roberto. ¿Cómo sería el posesivo para Roberto? El nombre de Roberto. Robert. 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 En inglés, Robert. Ponemos la comita, Robert. el apóstrofe y la S. Robert. Robert. Robert's Robert. class Robert. is at 8 p.m. ¿Es correcto? Robert's class is at AP. ¿Cuál es la posesión acá? Class. class. Aquí está el posesivo con nombre, apóstrofe S. No estoy diciendo que son muchos Roberto, ¿verdad? Estoy diciendo que la clase de Roberto. Uh -huh. Robert's, Robert. Robert's class Robert. is at 8 p.m. Okay. ¿Quién me tiene ahí interferencia, chicos? Cerrando esa puerta. Lucía. Ok. De televisión, de televisión. Esta bicha me abre la puerta. Ok. Va. <risa> oh ya my goodness. Pegó. In your face. Ya le pegó. Por In ejemplo. your face. Ok. Entonces, cuando es nombre es. Apostrophe S. Uh -huh. Yes. Pues, no okay. En el caso de Iris, que el nombre termina con S. Right? ¿Qué vamos a hacer para el posesivo? Oh, my God. Solo poner el apóstrofe. Hay varias formas. Ahí solo podemos poner el apóstrofe al final, ¿verdad? Después de, después de iris, el apóstrofe. Solo que sí tenemos que hacer como que una extra pronunciación ahí, como alargar el sonido ese. Iris. 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 Por ejemplo, Iris, do you have a, do you have a brother, Iris? Yeah. What's his name? Ivan. Complete. He, his name. His name is. Is. Ivan. Ok. Ivan. Entonces, para decir, el hermano de Iris es Ivan. ¿Cómo sería? Iris, brother, is Ivan. Ivan. Correct. Iris. 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 Y el apóstrofe. Brother. Iris. 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 Brother, is brother is Ivan. Is Ivan. Okay. Ivan. It is brother is brother. Ivan. Ivan. Okay, Oscar, do you have any brother. transportation? What? Do you use any transportation? Mm, bike. A bike? Do you have yeah, a, 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 a motorcycle? No. A bike? Yeah, just a bike, yeah. Okay, cool, cool, cool. So, Oscar has a bike, right? ¿Cómo puedo decir eh, usando possessive name? Esta es la bicicleta de Oscar. Oscar is it's, a bike. It's, 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 it's a bike. A Oscar bike. or Oscar's? Oscar's. Oscar's. Oscar's bike. It's Oscar's. It's a bike. ¿Qué estoy diciendo de interpretación? Esta, Esta es, la... es la bicicleta de Oscar. Correcto. Oscar. It's Oscar's bike. It's yes. Oscar. Victor, Victor, can you give an example? I, Victor. I, I put an a, a example. Raymond's. Oh, yeah. Raymond's cows are flat. Yeah. <laughs> okay. yeah. Raymond has cows. Do you have cows, <laughs> Raymond? He's a farmer. Really? Yeah. He's a farmer. So, Ray, so yeah, Raymond's cows. Repeat, guys. Raymond's cows. Raymond's cows. Are fat. Are fat. Are fat. Are fat. gorditas, right? Very good. Any questions so far? So far, so good. Let's finish this so video. So I'm going to draw a little chart to illustrate that. As you can see on this chart, if I talk about I, I will use the possessive adjective mm -hmm. my. 
and mine. If I talk about you, I will need to use your and yours. If I talk about he, I will need to use his and his. Mm. If I talk about she, I will need to use hers. her and hers. If I talk about it, I will need to use its and its. If I talk about we, I will need to use our and ours. If I talk about they, I will need to use their and theirs. The next thing to understand about this topic is when exactly you use. In order to explain that, I would like for you to look at the example on the screen. These are his socks. These socks are his. We want to keep the same example. So the first rule to learn is you will use possessive adjectives whenever the object is at the end of your sentence. For example, these are his socks. The object is socks. This is your umbrella. The object is umbrella. This is her car. Okay, guys, este tema is a little extens. We will continue with it tomorrow. Um, we're going to finalize with the attendance. Let me call the attendance. Cynthia Michelle Chavez Vargas, missing in action. Okay. Uh, Douglas Humberto Sanchez Diaz. I'm here. Thank you, sir. Hugo Ezequiel Deras Mauricio. I'm here. All right, still here, right? It is Yvette Sultana Lenarduzzi. I'm here, teacher. All right, Ivan Armando Mendez Parada. Uh, present. Jose Heriberto Cruz Amaya. I am here. All right, and Jose Balmore Cruz Montano. Juan Ramon Navarro Diaz. Thank you. Kathleen Stephanie Portillo de Lorenzana. I am here. All right. Lucia del Carmen Ayala Mejia. I am here, teacher. Luz Marlene Cornejo Alvarez. <coughs> Melvin Rafael Diaz Mijango. Present. All right. Noel Ernesto Vega Ortiz. Present. Noel, can you stay today, 10 minutes after the class? Okay. Thank you, sir. Let's continue with Oscar Armando Flores Rodriguez. I am here. Roberto Antonio Ramirez Gonzalez. Present. Ronnie Oswaldo Claros Flamenco. Present. The womanizer. The womanizer one, huh? Hey, very <laughs> quiet today, huh? Ah, yes. Sana Carolina Alfaro Gomez. Victor Manuel Andrade Galeas. I am here. Wendy Vanessa Diaz Hernandez. Okay, Jocelyn Lisbeth Angel Inglés. Present. Thank you, Carlos Eduardo Gomez Gomez. Present. Thank you, and Reina Mercedes Altagracia Barrientos. Present, teacher. Okay, Carla Lisette Valladares Flamenco. Present, teacher. All right, Jeanette Ismeray Gonzalez Rosa. And Ruben Enrique Reyes Cruz. Thank you for your attention, guys. Sinceramente, les pido mis más sinceras disculpas por las interrupciones que tuve este día. Inexplicablemente me siento, pues, impotente con eso. Espero mejorarlo. Thank you for your understanding. And I'll see you tomorrow.
at 8 p.m. That's okay. Congratulations. You always perform very well. Continue like this. Continue practicing. See you tomorrow. Teacher, en la plataforma no se pueden ver esos videos. Ah, uh, esto es algo adicional que su servidor les presenta. Ah, okay. Uh mm -hmm. Yep, yep, yep. Thanks. See you tomorrow. I will Thanks. stay with Noel. Noel, where's Noel? Ernesto Vega Ortiz. Mr. Noel. Welcome, Mr. Noel. ¿Cómo estamos, Mr. Noel? ¿Cómo se siente? Cuénteme sus impresiones del módulo en general, sus quejas, eh, sus dudas, sus miedos, sus sugerencias. Eh, ¿Cómo se ve usted ahorita eh, en cuanto a su progreso, eh, etcétera? Quiero saberlo todo en estos 10 minutos. La verdad que eh, ha sido poco. Sinceramente ha sido poco para mí. Eh, para empezar, de que es, mi, es primera vez, primera vez que yo me, me inscribo en algo, en concurso. Okay. He empezado de cero y entonces se me hace bien complicado entender, pronunciar, eh, porque según he visto, pues hay varios que, que ya sabían, no bastante, pero eh, aunque sea un poquito ya sabían. pues cuando ya tenía, Hay varios que tienen base, ¿cierto? Sí, tienen bastante conocimiento y yo inicié sin saber lo que es nada. Y sí, no le miento, en ningún momento vi... Eh, algunas clases de inglés en, en mi estudio, uh -huh. pero pues ya, ya hace bastante tiempo y desde entonces yo no, no volví a ver nada de esto. Pues, o sea, hasta hoy que, que se me presentó esta oportunidad, pero o sea, como le digo, según vi, ya iban bastante avanzados. Uh -huh. Entonces, sí, se me ha hecho un poquito complicado, la verdad. Para ¿Usted todos, siente, pues, siente como que... Um... Le da como miedito de practicar porque hay algunos compañeros que ya saben algo más. Eh, no es miedo, sino que es, como le digo, no tengo mayor conocimiento. Y sí, hay, hay, hay cosas que las entiendo y hay cosas que no. Hay cosas que las ignoro. Cuando a veces que eh, eh, te están elevando dos personas, yo no todo entiendo. No, no todo, pues. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Por eso siento que bueno. estoy ahí, estoy pendiente en las clases y todo, y sí acepto porque mi participación ha sido bien poca, por lo mismo que a veces no, no logro entender bien. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Lo que estoy haciendo, eh, apoyándome con las clases, en lo, hay cosas que yo las logro entender, las voy a poner en un cuaderno, en tiempos libres trato de, de, de practicar. Ah, practicar, eh, tratar de buscar palabras que tal vez no sé qué significan, las busco en español, traducir y así. Ok. Porque ¿Usted tiene realidad, alguien no. con quien practicar? Eh, ¿Aquí en el grupo? No, digamos un amigo, un compañero de trabajo, alguien cercano. Eh, sí, la verdad es que sí, pero por el trabajo es bien poco. Es bien poco tiempo lo que me queda. Ajá. Bien poco tiempo, pero sí ten, tengo con quien practicar, pero es bien poco tiempo lo que. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Bueno, es importante mencionarle, eh, Noel, que este es su nivel. Antes que nada, su nivel es este, ¿verdad? Eh, yes. Usted, igual, fíjese que ayer con quien tuve, no me acuerdo con quien tuve ayer, que me dijo algo bien parecido a lo que usted me está comentando. Creo que pero. Fue, eh, Melvin, ajá. creo. Melvin, Melvin, ajá, Melvin, sí, es cierto, igual que usted, ¿verdad? Él está súper, súper en la clase, este, asistiendo a su clase, honrando su oportunidad, ¿verdad? En Safor, representando su empresa, ¿verdad? De la mejor manera, asistiendo a clases, la participación me dijo que él, eh, igual que usted, ¿verdad? Porque hay muchos compañeros que ya se les nota que tienen un poquito más de conocimiento, pero bien por ellos, y bien por nosotros también, porque al, al escucharlos hablar, nosotros vamos eh, también educándonos, ¿verdad? Y en la forma en que hacemos las dinámicas, las los, los, los interacciones, eh, usted los escucha y usted más o menos tiene la idea de cómo ir. Ahora, 
no quiero que, que, que se sienta como que no está usted en el lugar que no es, porque aquí es, ¿verdad? Lo que pasa es que a veces nos emocionamos mucho, que a veces nos quedamos solo en inglés de repente, ¿verdad? Y hay muchos así como usted, así como tenemos participantes que ya tienen base, hay otros que empiezan de cero, igual como su persona, ¿verdad? Entonces, eh, yo también tengo que ser un poquito más flexible en ese caso. Eh, quizás cuando usted no sepa algo, me puede estar como que chateando, eh, me puede hacer una consulta en cualquier momento. Yo quiero que sienta la confianza de eso, Noel. Eh, cualquier pregunta, deténgame en la clase, interrúmpame. Usted es tan importante para mí como todos los participantes, ¿verdad? Es difícil quizás en, en estas horas, son 40 horas del módulo, eh, resolver todo. Pero mi, mi intención es como que prepararlos lo más posible para cuando vayan al siguiente módulo, o sea, empaparlos de bastante información. Eh, lo que usted puede hacer, pues, es tomar nota, ¿verdad? Ir absorbiendo lo mayor posible, porque para usted todo lo que ahorita estamos es ganancia, ¿verdad? Usted me dice que he estado a cero, es prácticamente la primera vez que usted agarra un curso así oficial, ¿verdad? Y pues, yo espero que no sea la última, ¿verdad? Eh, no, a usted, eh, dígame. La idea es seguir, pues, es seguir. Y... Porque... Tampoco quedarme solo con este poquito, sino que aprender, pero como le digo, voy de cero, pues entonces voy. Y usted está atrás, tomando pues, nota, usa un cuaderno o, o cómo. Eh, sí, sí, tengo un cuaderno donde voy apuntando. Vocabulario. Voy... Sí, sí. Por lo menos, por lo menos yo no le he enviado la, la, la tarea que dejo que era para hoy. Uh -huh. No se la he enviado. Le, El daily le routine. Sí, sí, las la rutinas del diario. A ver, ¿tiene alguna consulta ahí en ese daily routine? Pues no, ahí eh, tratando de eh, traducir y, y ahí más y o menos. pronunciar, sin... ¿verdad? Les puse la lista ahí de las acciones y pudieran agregar más. Ajá. Sí, ya, ya la hice. No, no se la he mandado, no sé si tengo que mandársela en un audio. En un no audio. Sé. En un audio. Y si necesita un día más, pues tómese el tiempo necesario porque lo que me interesa es que me las pronuncie lo mejor posible. Sí, eso es lo que estoy tratando porque como, como le digo, nunca había practicado. Hay palabras que yo las, las, las puedo ver y, y, y más o menos hacer una idea. ¿Y qué significa? ¿Y cómo se leen? ¿Cómo se pronuncia? Pero a la hora de pronunciar siento que me cuesta. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Bueno, ah, entonces... es importante que usted siempre esté conectado con el idioma de ahora en adelante, Noel. Eh, usted tiene que mantener una conexión 100%, es decir, todos los días. Usted está en un curso intensivo de inglés. Entonces, sí. usted tiene que mantener como que conexión, eh, escuchar canciones en inglés, eh, ver muñequitos, cartoons, sus, sus caricaturas favoritas, lo que a usted le divierte, ¿right? No, sí. Eso he hecho, desde que inicié con esto, igual, eh, canciones, bueno, bastante, bastante con lo que tiene que ver con inglés, eh, para tratar de más o menos un poquito educar el oído y saber un poquito de lo que, diferenciar las palabras más que todo. Vaya, a la hora de las interacciones, recuerde que siempre hay un saludo, ¿verdad? Usted dice, hi. Sí. Y dice el nombre sí. del compañero, por ejemplo, hi Alex. Right? Uh, hi Alex. Y le pregunto a usted, how are you? Ahí me uh, le pone ahí el, quiero ver el, el question mark, el question mark. Hi Alex. How are you? Right? Y luego pues preparamos al compañero para hacerle la pregunta. Vamos a decirle I have a question for you. Ok. Y esto es, esto es algo que hacemos casi todos los días. Y, y nos ayuda a mejorar nuestro, nuestro hablado, ¿verdad? Sí. Para introducir la pregunta, I have a question for you. Repeat, I have a question for you. I have a question for you. Yes. Usted saluda al compañero. Eh, también para romper el hielo puede decir excuse me, ¿verdad? Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me, Roberto. 
Excuse okay. me, Roberto. Verifica si lo están oyendo. Usted dice, can you, puedes oírme. Can, de poder, de habilidad. Can you hear, de escuchar. Can you hear me? Repeat. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Very can well. You can you hear me, Roberto? Ok, Roberto le dice, yes, I can. Luego usted le dice, I have a question for you, ¿verdad? Y eh, introduce la pregunta de la práctica, right? Vamos a ver ahorita, eh, Noel, what time is it? What time is it right now? What time is it? Eh, a la hora, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. eh, sería... It's... E -X, X, what time? No, X. It's uh -huh. 10. E X 10, it sería. X 10, eh, one... Bueno, no, yo tengo las, is, las 10 y 10, tengo 10, yo ya. 10 y 10. It's 10, ah, 10. 10. 10. It's 10, sí, 10. Sí, sería. It's 10, 10 sería. Ajá, puedes decir también, it's 10. It's 10. After. After. 10. It's 10 after 10. 10 after 10. Que son 10 pasadas las 10. Ok. Sigamos adelante, Noel. Todo para ti ahorita es ganancia, right? Todo lo que tú aprendas, sí. por poquito o mucho que sea, pues es bienvenido, pues es, es tu primer curso. Así que sigamos adelante, aprovechemos. Nos queda como semana y media para seguirnos divirtiendo, ¿ok? Sí, todavía falta la mitad prácticamente. Vamos súper bien. So, let's continue like that. Have a good night, my friend. I'll see you tomorrow. No, good night. Good night, my brother. Goodbye.